Feature Friday. The freshest. <laughs> Tawak Nang Tahalang is like a legacy TV show. We didn't know this went this deep, so... I had no idea. So, you guys sent me a, a, a message explaining when the first Tawak was televised in 1954. What? So, I did a little bit of research and I tried to find out who was one of like the most... The, the, one of the first champions or was ever... Uh, that build a career out of the, the, the whole competition singing in television. And so Nora Aunur, Aunur came, came around. Uh, so we're going to check out some of the pinnacle moments of Tawak in 1954. Damn, this, this show is old as hell, It's dude. old. So this is like her winning song, uh, Nora's winning song in Tawak. It's the live recording of the TV, like what happened live. She was like 16, I think. Done. Darling, let me catch my breath. How great is that? I've never seen. Oh, 1967. She won. Quite so lovely. How did you ever learn? This is live bands, live TV, everything live. Oh yeah, back then auto tune or pitch correction wasn't a thing, dude. No, no, no. Not that Tawag uses it. After the show production, people, the judges, and friends extended their congratulations to the winners and posted their souvenir picture. Uh, in front, proudly beaming and holding the trophy is Elizabeth Ledesma, this year's winner, and Nora Aunor, last year's winner. How freaking crazy, man! That's like legacy stuff. What a song! She must be like what, seventy now? Around that age, I think. Presenting the past and present. That one, man, the Halak champion. <laughs> Her career skyrocketed after this. Those are, the, those are the holding school diploma. <laughs> they are. It looks like a graduation picture. She had gorgeous hair. It's gorgeous. like Pilita Corrales. Time, it right? is, it is. I wonder if they ever met. Probably. They definitely sang together. That's for sure. You know what's funny? Bali actually found the video. Uh, yeah. This is a performance of her backing when she was 16 years old. When she was doing press. How the f did you find this video? Listen, listen. I did some heavy research. Oh, what? what a voice. Oh, nice. Wow, finish on a freaking major chord. And this, of course, I found more. <laughs> this is another video of her. This, this, this is, is like, her music video. Yes, yes. Shut up. We're gonna this is, I think this is the song that, that wins her. That wins a Tawag. Moonlight but, becomes you. What? Hold yeah, on, yeah so I think that's the song that it makes her a champion. She's she's still uh yeah she's seventy years old. She's an actress. It she says looks now. great though. Oh my god. She's done a ton of movies. That's so cool. She did one in 2012. It says Nora Cabaltera Villamayor. Damn, what a name. Nora Cabaltera Villamayor. Popularity known as Nora Aunor is a Filipina actress, recording artist, and film producer. She's also been to the moon and back. <laughs> Jeez, <laughs> Aunor has also appeared in several stage plays, television shows, and concerts. She is from the city of Iriga, or Iriga, Philippines. Nice, Iriga, right? my God. 
it's just fabulous. So her career She's actually was, laun- l- was launched into, into fruition because of Tawag. She won the Order of National Artists of the Philippines. It's an order bestowed on Philippines nationals who have made significant contributions to the development of Philippine art. Members of the order are known as national artists. Jesus My Christ. God, the president the gave, me, gave her an award. What wow, the fuck? Wow, that's so cool, no? This is the winning song, okay? Just so this is one, like, yeah? all right, just watch. Ah, I love this I wouldn't even videos, know bro. who to email to not get blocked for this. I have no idea. This, this is like so nearly a cool. hundred years old. Nah, it no, wasn't. It wasn't even years. CB. It wasn't even CB. A- ABS CBN yet. Somebody else takes over. My God, the freaking angles! Stand there just a moment. Ooh. Darling, let me catch my breath. I've never seen a picture. It's so lovely. How <laughs> it's did so you great. So also, the maturity in her voice does not match what we're seeing. How is she 16? No idea. How was she 16? What a fantastic singer. What a fantastic a song. Becomes you. I'm thrilled of the and I could get so Oh, I feel till it's transported, like you really are moved to another time. Oh man, the good old days. Right, right I have good I wasn't old days. even alive. I miss those days. What? I, think, I guess our father was like barely born here. Yeah. Yeah. He must have been like three years old. Literally. Oh, he wasn't even born. Yeah, he wasn't born yet. Two years into it. When was our father born? <laughs> <laughs> Has he come back from getting the milk yet? <laughs> what a night to be listening to this. There's such a nostalgic thing about this. I have no idea why. The outfit, the, everything. <laughs> Come on, dog. My God! It's Crazy. absolutely phenomenal. I, again, I just thought it was a, a cool piece of trivia that I thought I'd dig into a little bit further. So, because it's, you know, how fabulous it is to go back in time like this. So Tower began in 1954. That's right. And, and so the first incarnation was that's 19, right. se- 1954 to 1972 and the second incarnation is is then ta- uh, taken by abs cbn but before that one. yeah before that it was owned by a different tv network that was dw something what yeah really mm-hmm. i see oh yeah the dz ah, there you go aq TV. tv now dwx tv which is why do we have the same logo as abs the Maybe flagship, it oh, it's part of the network. Mm-hmm. Well, ABS just owns everything, doesn't it? <laughs> well, yeah. They do. They, 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 just, they actually they do. do. They do. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, 
I see. Right. Very cool. I, I Isn't thought, it freaking awesome, What a good though? video, mate. Anyways, I don't know how fun this was to watch, but it's certainly super interesting for us. And I think it helps a lot for us to learn, like, legacy... Le legacy? Legacy um, shows like this one and to learn the actual stories, the actual history of it, and to learn some of the biggest stars at the time that perhaps now we would have never been introduced to if we did not do some research and some Correct. of you guys sent us these specific links. So thank you so much for thank that. Thank you so much for reigniting that curiosity and like helping us understand how deep it runs, Absolutely. the culture of singing competitions and singing in the Philippines.